You have entered the Chronix rabbit hole. Roger, Mora, Thiago, our metal family from across the sea. Thank you so much for your request today. You are bringing something new down the rabbit hole by the name of Skull Mold and the Symphonial Jomsvelt Islands. And the song's name is Convoning, and I think it means the Iceland Symphonic Orchestra. So that sounds amazing. I can't wait to see why all three of you love this song so much. Thank you so much, Rajay, Mara, and Thiago for bringing this down our way. Thank you all so much for being here and family for giving us a little context of this new band and the song that we're doing today. This is the write-up. There is a video with the Icelandic lyrics translated into English, but we think that will distract too much attention, which is fully needed for the performance itself. Ooh. You'll need all eyes and ears to enjoy this one to the fullest. We will ask extra attention for the happiest drummer that we ever saw. Next to that, the four guitars are giving a hell of a show, especially during the triple solo. Wow. Here we go. The song itself is about a man seeking revenge after a foreign foe killed his wife and children. Very atrocious, of course, but not strange to Viking period cruelties. Mm. That sounds like the gladiators story. It does. Woo, this is going to be good. Raje, Mara, and Thiago, that was such an amazing write-up. I can't wait to get into this amazing orchestra with the four guitars, triple solos, and just everything that's going on, and this is going to be such an extraordinary piece. This, I'm so thankful that you brought this our way, as this is our very first time experiencing the Icelandic orchestra, and this is, I just blown away at already the size of what it looks like no on kidding, screen eh? here. If you guys are as excited to be with us today with Skalmold and Symphonial Jules Viet Island Cavoning, then remember to like this video, comment down below some of your favorites from this orchestra, from this um, collaboration even that we have here, and subscribe if you haven't already so you never miss a video coming down the rabbit hole. There's also a happy drummer here, so will be laser focused. Normally we're one of those people that like to have subtitles, but you make a good point, Roger and family, that it can sometimes take away from the full experience if you're mm. looking at the lyrics. So we're gonna really pay attention to the instruments here and we're very excited because it has everything that we like about music. You hear the timpani already. Yeah, what a way to start, eh? I just want to start by saying that sounded so familiar, though I feel like it's it was their own thing still, but it had some of those like just classical, it feels like a classic already is more what I'm saying. Absolutely. <laughs> the moment it started, do, 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 yeah. do, 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 I instantly thought I had heard it before. I'm like, wait a second, what is this? But then as it was started going into the metal, I'm like, no, I haven't heard this before, but there's something so familiar about the song even if it's been used in audio or yeah. like used in other little games snippets, and like something. little snippets but it's influenced you can exactly. see exactly right? yeah, you can tell that this has influenced things that we have experienced yes. growing up yeah 100 percent
beautiful. I don't know why I was expecting a clean singer, but this is nice that it's a growl. Yeah, I, right? re- I really love his growl. Yes, me too. And this was such a good intro into like the rest of the song. Yes. To really get us hyped for it. That's for sure. <laughs> and I love that you know some of the different instruments that I don't know, like the mm-hmm. timpani and all that, so you can kind of pick them out more. Yeah, like, um, I'm not sure the exact name of the, it wasn't a clarinet, but it wasn't a bassoon, but it's like in between in that family. There's like so many of them. Um, but how they started out with the, I love how they started with that and then brought everyone else. Exactly. In. Yeah, it was really stripped down and they just kept layering it Absolutely, because a lot of the times we hear them start with like violins or we hear them start with like the guitar. Very like, true. Them start with the, um, the, the woodwinds, like, um the violins and then the flutes i forget what they are but they're another wind instrument right those are the ones that they typically start with so hearing Mm -hmm. them start with like that one really made me happy with this song yeah this is unique i like the drummer too yeah he's so happy he had a big smile the whole time actually so did the main thing or two yeah smiling big Get the goosies. <laughs> they see what we're doing. <laughs>
Yes, I love it. Wait for this. You're, you're so right. If there was lyrics in English there and we were trying to like see what it was really saying, I, I do think that would have distracted from yeah. the beauty of what was just happening in front of us because that was exceptional. The singer also remind me a bit of like the Moon Sorrow singer a little he bit. He did. He did remind me a little bit of the Moon Sorrow singer just with his growl and kind of how raspy his growl exactly, sounded. It was right? very airy for a growl, I yeah. found. Yeah um beautiful song i loved how happy everyone is like that was no something kidding. like Thar thiago mara and raje you had mentioned that just how happy the drummer was but that's for sure everyone was super happy in this yeah. and was oh, yeah. just smiling and beaming they're and happy about this collaboration it looked they like they loved this collaboration it really makes me wonder if they've ever played with a live orchestra full through like that before because and the reason i'm wondering this is when they were standing on stage they were all turned around and looking mm. away i see what you mean but then yeah. the one guy had he just he had to look back yeah and see the audience really reaction and see what was going on yeah and then he tapped his guys like buddy look yeah don't miss this like don't miss this yeah. and then they all turned around and they were like holding each other on stage very true just taking in that moment of like wow we did this yeah look what we were able to create look at what we were able to bring to life with this well they definitely don't normally travel with them like with no. the temptation with that black orchestra it was one of those type of absolutely. moments that you're suggesting absolutely yeah. and i don't think they would not many bands travel with a full orchestra no, that's, that's a but that's journey. why it made me wonder if this was their first time it looked traveling. like it meant that much and it, it could have been like their first meant for sure that much to, and they were just so smiles and maybe they're just that enthusiastic at Every just that single, big of fans as well. Right, that big of fans. Because that orchestra and symphony looks like it's yeah. one of the main ones from Iceland that like people probably use a lot for all those moments yeah. too, right? And they did so good. Especially because we forget this was a song about like vengeance, right? About your family yeah. and all that. But it was... Maybe vengeance is the sweetest thing too, right? Like after being that yeah. low to get that high again, we want revenge too. We just got our cell phone stolen. So there's a lot of us that want that sweet revenge to get that mm -hmm. bone back and that release. And that's what this song kind of felt like. It was that ultimate release, you know? Absolutely. It definitely did feel like that ultimate release. There was that moment right in the middle. Cause it was like, I was like, oh, this is a really good intro. It almost felt yeah. like it was two separate songs. It but Big then, time. and so like I was kind of talking and it thinking, oh yeah, this is like the intro, you know, like maybe we're doing like a two for one kind of deal where we started the song and now we're going to the second song. Mm -hmm. But no, they had just quieted down that much and brought it down into like that whisper. Yeah. And it, with it being a song of <laughs> loss and vengeance, that made it made such a that. It's so perfect that they had that bowl in there and then being able to fully experience everything that was happening. Yeah. Like, beautifully done to make that vengeance oh so sweet. And I think that happened at the solo. <laughs> yeah, it did. That's then the solo the came solo. in and then that was that solo. <laughs> but I like what you said because, like, we did focus on the drummer a lot because you were saying mm -hmm. to it with how happy, but everyone was that happy. And for us, we're really enthusiastic people. So getting to see that when we're experiencing that really yeah. makes us want to come back to that. So please let us know if you want us to check them out again. And Rajay, Mara, Thiago, thank you so much for bringing us a new experience. We always love experiencing something new. It opens up new proteins mm -hmm. in the body, as you all know. Hopefully you all had a good time, though, as well. We are now exiting the rabbit hole, folks. Thank you all for being here with us. Thank you so much, Rajay, Thiago, and Mara for bringing this down the rabbit hole. I can't wait to see what else you have in store. Peace and love, everyone. Also, Winter Sun has a new album coming out, Time 2. And I know y'all would be very excited about that too. So God bless y'all. God bless. You need to learn how to, to play that on the guitar now. Take care and bye for now.
Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe for more Enter the Chronicness. Special thanks to all of our YouTube, Patreon, and Buy Me a Coffee members. Thank you for all of your support. Thank you so much for making it all the way to the very end of the video. And if you have not yet done this, here's an easy way to subscribe to our channel. And if you want to subscribe to the artist that you just heard, here's an easy way to do that as well. And if you are also interested in finding a video that you might like, just click here. Thank you so much for coming to the channel. Peace and love, everyone. God bless y'all. Take care. Bye for now.